Welcome to the video everyone, today we will see top 5 best games like being a dick, if you are seeing our video for the first time then check out our channel we make videos related to being a dick and other visual novels, and if you like what you see then stick around for more videos. Now let's begin. Being a dick is a masterpiece, so for you we have found 5 games for you all so that you will get, similar experience by playing these games as you got with being a dick. Also these are not some average games which everyone knows about, these are some of the best hand picked games by me for you also be sure to check them out. On number 5 we have, Isabella, Dark Paths by Bad Tomatils. Overview, Isabella. Dark Paths is an erotic thriller with adult elements. A dead girlfriend, a broken heart, a mysterious shadowy old man, and a smoking hot supermodel. This is a solid entry in a subgenre of adult visual novels that is otherwise underperforming the erotic thriller. Many defs are able to produce an erotic game, but few are able to produce one that can properly be called a thriller. Bad Tomatils is one of the best new defs in the adult indie scene. Solid renders, animations, dialogue, and use of music. But where he really shines is on plot. Through chapter 3.1 he's frequently been able to create moments of genuine drama and anticipation. This is where he triumphs over most other defs who mask their inability to tell an engaging story with cheap sexual tropes. This game leaves you actually looking forward to the progression of the plot, not just the progression of your sexual relationships. There are several mysteries presented in this game, each one leaving you trying to puzzle it out. BTT is doing a good job of keeping the player's interest by releasing answers to some of the questions while continuing to build up the other ones. Overall good sounds, as animation and decent amount of loot scenes. The girls are nice and have their own personalities, the renders are nice, the plot is well done and intriguing. It's doing a good job of keeping attention. There are no slow or dull points. It's still overall early in the plot still I think but so far it's all promising. Moving on to number 4, we have, Dreams of Reality by Sink. Overview. Tragedy can bring people together or rip them apart. Dreams of Reality A visual novel by Sink. A regular family, a mother with a blossoming artistic career and a daughter about to embark on the next stage of her life. And you, the father, with dreams and aspirations to become a professional DJ in the club scene. It may be simple, but life couldn't be better. That is, until the cruel hand of fate decides to intervene and threaten that stability. As your world is pulled away and your grip on reality is at risk, the support of family and friends will be vital to pull you through. But fate is not finished and a chance encounter with a young woman could well be your undoing, or perhaps, your hope for sanity. Meanwhile, the sinister forces that sent your life and mind into turmoil still lurk in the shadows and endanger all you hold dear. It's up to you to help our tortured hero conquer his demons. Dreams of Reality is a, heavily choice based VN. There will be multiple endings that will vary quite differently from each other. This VN does not shy away from difficult topics and as such, reader discretion is advised. This one is a gem and very much underrated. If you love playing games which gives more importance to the story this one is the perfect choice for you. Renders are not that top notch like some top rated games here. But it isn't mediocre either. At the start there are some grainy images but you can see increase in quality. Dev didn't get that much financial support but still he is taking a lot of effort with this one. He also added sound effects for more ambience. Without a doubt this is one of the best story focused game. If you enjoy playing story focused game, give this one a try you won't regret it. Heavily story focused, emotional and gives some tensions, decent renders and models, you can see increase in quality, sound effects, not in earlier versions later it is added. Good writing, 
many choices to make. Loving wife Louise. Other characters are nice too, very underrated this one truly deserves more attention. On number 3 we have, City of Broken, Dreamers by Philly Games. Overview, Los Angeles, 2042. A city ruled by corporations. A city ruled by the elite. A city that exemplifies the best and worst of the American dream. Millions live their lives in almost blissful ignorance of the excesses of the rich, or the degradation of the poor. Executives hold more power than politicians, the police hold less power than corporate mercenaries. You are, one of those mercenaries, one of the best, and elite tier called ghosts. But you haven't taken a job in months. That is about to change. Elsewhere in the city, a young girl is about to become the center of a conflict that could tear the city apart. As you track her down you'll have allies and enemies, others like you who have been used by the city and spit out. Who will you trust? Who can you, afford to? Each of them has their own dreams, their own motivations, each is broken in their own way. All of it will come together, in the city of broken dreamers. Honestly this one of the best visual novels, when it comes to the 3D animation and high quality renders. The game has stunning girls, incredibly high quality models that feel realistic. The story is dark and mature, without engaging, in excessive drama nor stupid jokes. Pros of the game are, fantastic characters. Gripping storyline. While nothing extremely new, the plot plays well into the cyberpunk cliches and crafts a very interesting story that doesn't waste time. Amazing soundtrack. It's eerie, topical and evocative. It sets the mood perfectly and there's enough variation. It's just a top tier track list. The only con, of the game is, it has kinda slow development. Nothing more to say about this. Overall, this is must try visual novel if you like futuristic theme, I am sure you would enjoy every single second of it. Moving on to number 2, Bear Witness by Alter Worlds. Overview, when a young man heads off to art school after a major upheaval in his life, he has no idea that someone from his past is waiting there, to potentially cause further disaster. Graphics slash art, it is obvious that the dev takes great efforts in their art and assets. The character are unique. The environments are fresh. Graphical quality is very high, and the animations are pretty good. There is certainly plenty of eye candy in the game, both in terms of lewd activities, as well as just the day-to-day -day stuff. Audio, their witness has, full audio, which is great. While many turn off the music and sounds, I personally find that this detracts from games where devs have taken the time to do proper audio engineering. The music isn't the same royalty-free stuff that appears in most games. It fits the scenes and the moods quite well. Recommend that you don't turn it off. Story and writing, the story is quite good, and is accompanied, by extremely high quality writing. The relationships with the girls build a little too quickly for my liking, but that is purely a personal preference, and I would not downrate the game for this. The writing is obviously English first, without a single grammatical error. The grammar police will be proud. Gameplay, this is a choice driven VN. Your choices do have an impact on how things play out, sometimes, the right answer isn't obvious, but that's okay with me. I'm more of a do what you would actually do kind of person, and so far, it hasn't led me astray. Final thoughts, the dev obviously cares about the quality of the game. Significant efforts seem to have been taken on pretty much every aspect. If you're looking for a new story driven game to get started on, with cute girls and lots of options, you won't go wrong with this. Finally on number 1 we have, One Tales from the Unending Void by Pervertir. Overview, Cameron is a young minor noble from the Sovereignty, 
a part of space dominated by humans. Erstwhile cadet of the Terran Naval Academy, Cam has been forced by circumstances to travel the galaxy, together with a band of friends, taking on menial jobs and occasionally, smuggling some illicit cargo, as he involuntarily becomes part of sinister plans machinated by powerful intrigants, Cameron's life is changed forever. A very unique and interesting game that's mixed up with an adventurous story in space. Story progression is slow and complex but it gets better with the pace and as you go. Trust me I'm not doing justice to the game on how good the story get along, with its plot twists. Amazing visuals, absolutely loving the aesthetic environment and vibe, music overall. Amazing character models. Amazing animations. And if it weren't for those silly and goofy dialogues then I don't think I would have been addicted to the game as I am now. I would really love to see how story folds and blow my mind with each new update to its story and how it's gonna end at last. Thank you creating tales from the unending void perverted. Overall I would like to say, if you like the games with space and universe theme, then this the one you are looking for. Also this game's season 1 is completed and now season 2 is under development. So guys these were the top 5 best games like being a dick, and at last I would like to say that, it's fine if you don't subscribe to, our channel. But if you got a dollar to spare then please consider supporting the creators of these games, because put in so much effort for making these games and the least they could expect is the support from you guys. Show them your love and support, they really deserve it. That's it for today's video, you will find the download link for all these games in the pinned comment. Also comment below and let me know how many games from the list you knew before watching this video and also which game did you like most from the list. Thank you for watching and see you later.